All right. All right, players. All right, let's start with some stretches. Let's start with um, half butterfly, okay? So let's try and get this organized so you guys can see me and I can see you. Okay, so half butterfly is where we bring one leg in. So you kind of go sitting like this, okay? One leg's out, one leg's in. You're sitting up nice and tall, okay? And you're just gonna bring your knee up and press it down, okay? We're just gonna do this. Is, this is something I also would probably do in yoga class, and I know this isn't yoga today, but I wanna just start with just a few stretches, and we're gonna be doing our body weight stuff on the mat first, and then we'll work our way up. So pressing down, you should feel your hips open up, so one leg's in, one leg straight, you're sitting up nice and tall. And, and if you want to think about your breathing, you can bring one knee up. I mean, one on your knee. When your knee comes up, you can inhale. When you press down, you exhale. Let's just do a few more. Turn it up. Turn it up. Turn it up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, now you guys are in two. That's not to take. Shut your. Um, mute your. Yeah, shut your. Mute your. Um, <laughs> players, go ahead and mute yourselves. Go ahead and bring your knee in. And go to the other side. So knee up, knee down, knee up, knee down. That's it. Sitting up nice and tall, because remember we're working on our body weight, we're always working on our core. Another 15 seconds. And bring your knee in, stretch your legs out. All right, now go back to the first side. Now onto the hamstrings. So turn your body so it's towards your straight leg. Okay, and we're gonna take a deep breath in and reach as far forward as you can. So slide your hands. Maybe you can easily grab your ankle. Maybe you can grab your foot. But if you're hurting your back, back up a little bit. And just hold, pointing your toes upward. Josh, go ahead and come forward, Josh. There you go. No, 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 no. Just slowly, just hold. Don't, you don't need to bounce. Just hold. All right, and come back up. Change sides. Bring the other leg in. Turn your body toward that outgoing leg. Slide your fingertips. See how you're, Lily, see how you're kind of doing this? Can you see if you can? Make your spine strong and try to put your belly on top of your thigh. So maybe you only come like this. That's okay. That's it. That's better. Good. And come up. All right. All right. Let's do one more. Let's take both legs out to the sides. Okay. And take your hands in front of you, stretch out, and reach forward. Keep your toes turned up. Boys, just reach forward. Hold. That's it. And come up. We'll do that one more time. Now we're stretching out the inside of the thighs one more time. Slide forward. Reach and reach. Take a few deep breaths. The zoo over there. All right. And come up. So we're going to start with our sit up. So we're kind of doing a reverse class today. So we're going to start with some 
Very simple sit-ups. Okay, we're gonna do a couple different kinds. All right, so first one is just sliding the fingertips. We've done that one before. So we're gonna do two sets of 10. Okay, so hands on your thighs. Take a breath in, exhale, slide your fingertips up, take your shoulders off the mat or the floor, and then inhale back down. Exhale up, that's two. Three. Four. Five, hold. Six. Shoulders come off the mat. Seven. Eight, nine, and, and the tenth one we hold in the up position. Ten for one, two, three, and come down. Bring your knees in. Stretch your legs out for a second. And we go again. All right, bend those knees again. Okay. Bend your knees, hands on your thighs. Anton, lie down. Oh, there's a little girl now. What is going on? And there's two of her. It's crazy. Hands here. Get ready. And up. One, two, three, four. Hold. Pause at the top. Five. Six, chin off your chest, seven, eight, nine, ten, hold, one, two, three, and down. Again, bring your knees in, stretch your legs out, bring your arms above your head. Maybe I need to do a little twist, so maybe you might need to do a little twist. You're on your back now. Bring your knees up and just twist your knees to one side. Look the opposite way. If you're just, just kind of, we're warming up our abdominals with those first two sets. And then bring your knees back up and then go the other way. Look, the opposite, look toward the opposite direction of your knees and then come back up. Okay. Now, this is something we haven't done yet. This is called reverse marches. So watch me first. You bring your legs up in a table position. And we're going to start with tapping your toe. And then you bring your knee up. You tap your toe. And then you bring your knee up. But you're using your core. Players, look at my knees. So my knees are directly over my hips. They're not this way. And they're not out here. My feet are in a half, half square. Okay, your palms are down. Get ready. Touch your right toe. Bring it up, touch your left toe. Use your core to bring it up. Right toe, up, left toe, up. Keep going. We're gonna do this one for another 40 seconds. Down and up. If it's easy, you might not be doing it right. So if you want to watch me, keep watching me. Anton, look at what Coach Chris is doing. I'm doing one knee at a time. And then I'm pulling it back up like I'm pulling it through molasses. Like syrup. Okay? So I'm not just kicking my knees up and down. Five seconds. And stop. Straighten your legs up to the sky or, the, or your uh, ceiling. Just stretch your feet out. Just stretch them straight up. Up, up. Straighten those knees out. Anton, straighten your knees. Hold them up. That's it. Pull your belly in and slowly lower your legs straight. That's it, Lily. Lower your legs straight. Stretch your arms out again. Just 
All right, this time, bring those knees back up. Bring them back up. This time, clasp your hands. Take your hands in your head, or put, put your head in your hands. Elbows are out to the side. Pretend that you've got an orange or something underneath your chin. We've got 10 this way. So you're gonna inhale, exhale, lift up. Feel that crunch and come back down. Come up two, down, three, down, four, down, five. My knees are over my hips, down, six, down, up seven, down, up eight. Watch your chin, keep your chin off your chest. Nine and 10, we hold. 10, we hold one, two, three, and relax. Stretch your legs out. All right, we gotta do that one again. Bring those knees back up. Clasp your hands behind your head. So just let your head rest in your hands. Try not to pull your neck when you do these, okay? We have 10. Your knees are over your hips. Get ready, belly's pulled in. Inhale, exhale, lift one and down. Two and down. Three and down. Four and down. Five, six, chin off your chest. Seven, eight, nine, 10, hold, two, three, four, and release. Bring your legs down. All right. This time we're gonna do double leg lifts. Okay, this is not easy. You're gonna take your hands. Place them underneath your tailbone or, or underneath each butt cheek so you give yourself some support. So you're going to literally lift your legs up together and then you're going to slowly lower like we just did. Okay? All right, so hands are underneath your bottom. You can make a triangle with your fingers to kind of give you some support in your low back. Take a deep breath in. Dive your belly button down and then inhale up with the legs, take a breath in, exhale lower, inhale lift or exhale, whatever, however you wanna breathe, you can choose and lower, keep going, legs are straight, up and try to do 10, that was three, at least I've done three. And Lily's done three, four. Legs are straight players. Five. Six, think about that belly button. Diving down right as you lift those legs. Seven. Exhale or inhale, depending on what feels good. Eight, as you lift your legs. Nine. And 10. And bring those legs down. Stretch out. All right. All right, we have just two more sets for our core, our abs this way, and then we're gonna turn and work on our core from our abdomen, okay? So bend those knees. This is the one where we go. We're gonna do 10 like, we'll do two sets of 10. All right, are you ready? And get ready and up one. Two, lift those arms up so they come by your sides and you lift three, four, five, six, 
Try to exhale as you lift here. Seven, that kind of works best for this one. Eight, nine, 10, and lower. And rest, we got one more like that. How are you feeling? Thumbs up or thumbs down? All right, good. Thumbs up, come on. Ready, another set, get ready. Anton, let's go. Another set. All right, get ready, hands by your side. Belly buttons pulled down toward the mat or the floor. Take a breath in and then exhale, lift up. One, two, three. Feet down, Josh, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10 and one for good luck and one for good luck. Good. Awesome. All right, go ahead and roll over. Do a counter stretch. Just come into a crocodile and mentally prepare for a bunch of planks and some push-ups. <laughs> so cute. Hi, cutie. <laughs> All right, so we have elbow, elbow planks, then we have arm planks today, and then we're gonna try some, we're gonna do our modified push-ups today, and we might try just a few full push-ups, and then we're gonna stand up. All right, so we're gonna start with our two, two mod uh, two uh, elbow planks for 30 seconds. Okay, so go ahead and get ready. Elbows underneath your shoulders. Clasp your hands. Roll your toes under. Get ready, players. And lift those hips. Press your heels back. And hold. Fifteen seconds. Keep pushing your heels back. Feel the stretch in your calves. Pull your belly button towards your spine. Five, four, three, two, one, and down. All right. And we got another one. So just stretch our back out a little bit. Feel that nice extension in your back. 15 seconds to another 30. Get ready, roll your toes under, clasp your hands, and <clears throat> come on up and lift. Lift up, push those heels back, belly buttons pulls up now. You look straight down at your forearms. You only have 10 more seconds. And release. Okay. Stretch your arms out if you need to. We're going to go into. She did it the whole time. We're going to do two sets of modified push ups. All right, get ready. <clears throat> Modified push-ups. So we're gonna do two sets of, well, let's say the first set will be 10 and then we'll see how we do for the second set. All right, get ready. Okay, come to that front top part of your knee, cross your feet, get into your nice angle. Anton, you're not working very hard. I can just tell. Focus, kid. Focus. <laughs> Get ready. 10. Come on down. That's 10. 9. 8. 
That's it, Lily. Seven. Six. Keep going, Josh. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Press your hips back. I hope those are getting easier. They should be. You can bring your arms behind you to give them a break. All right, let's try for 15. Can you do 15? 15? Try. Try, just try. You got it? Okay, Lily, let's go. Come into position. Spread your fingertips, grab the ground, belly button pulls up. Maybe take your arms wider on this one. That might make it a little easier when you get tired. Get ready and down. That's 15, 14, 13. Exhale as you push, 12 off the ground, 11, 10, 9, 8, Seven, keep it going. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Push our hips back. Come into child's pose. Bring those arms behind you. Rest your head. All right, now we've got two regular planks and let's do those for, let's do the first one for 20 and then we might do the second one for 30, okay? But we'll come through downward facing dog, okay? So come into your table position. Let's just stretch the back of our bodies out a little bit. So come on up because we got to get ready. We're going to be doing our leg stuff soon, so. Go ahead and stretch the back of your body out a little bit. Okay, get ready. Coming into full plank, 20 seconds. Belly button's pulled in, push your hips back. Push those heels back. Keep that belly pulled up. And breathe, deep breaths. Five seconds. Uh, 20 seconds is easy. Go ahead and push your hips back and come on down. That was pretty easy, huh? Get your wrist going. My foot's, about to, my foot's cramping for some reason. Let's try for, do you think you do 30? Let's go for 30. All right, get ready. Hands underneath your shoulders. Actually, let's come through. Let's come through downward dog again. So go ahead and come through downward dog. Okay, get ready. And come in. Push your hips. Push your toes back, or I'm sorry, your heels back. And keep pushing the ground away. That's it. Looking good. Hold it. 15 seconds, 10 seconds, three, two, one, come up and back. Shake your arms out. All right, we're gonna make our way, we're gonna start making our way up. But we're going to start with kind of stretching a little bit. So step forward into that runner's lunge. So we're going to be doing some lunges and squats. So feeling a nice stretch in your hip. These are your hip flexors here. Stretch in your groin. And then push back. Switch sides.
Again, feeling that big stretch right here. All right, come back. We're gonna do one more. This time it's gonna be a little different. Let me mix back my mat up so you can see me. So you're gonna step forward with the opposite leg. Then put whatever foot's forward, put the opposite arm down, palm down, and twist. Good. Look up, look up at your arm. That's it. And just look right up at your arm. Should you feel a nice stretch in your shoulder. Okay, come down, push back and switch. You're in the runner's lunge, and then you put your hand down and you look in the same direction of the bent knee, but up. Okay, come down, come back. Let's come up through downward facing dog. All right, and get ready because we're going to be and jump up, roll up slowly. And now we got to do, now we got to do some legs. All right. All right, players. Oh, look at her. She's like ready for yoga class, that one. Okay, let's go ahead and start with, let's start with some lunges. So I think you guys were on the call on, I don't know, whatever day we did, Plyometrics Tuesday. So we did a lot of forward and backwards. So we're gonna do the, we're gonna do the split lunge. Actually, we're gonna do front, side, and back, okay? So we're gonna start. So I'll face you, you can pick the same leg as me and just mirror me, okay? I'm gonna start with this side. So step forward, push on your heel, step back, step to this side, that's it, Anton, you got it. Come up, now go back. Good, that's it, guys. Good job, Lily. Step forward, together, step to the side, push on your heel, Step back, together, awesome. Step forward, three, together, three, to the side, together, and then back, together. Four, push, we're gonna do 10 on each side, so settle in, kiddos, push on your heels, step back, back, stay straight, good job. Five, push, five to the side, Five back, good job. And forward, six, push on the heels. Your squads are getting so strong. And back. And your core is, because you're, I see all of you really keeping your core upright. You're not bending over. Good. And seven forward, push on the heel. On the side, push on the heel, good. Good, nice Lily. Nine forward, nine to the side, nine back, and 10. Good, shake it out. Get ready for the other side. Let's go, and forward, and push through that heel now, then to the side, then back, that's one, and forward, whoops, to the side, and back, that's two.
and three. Good job. Push on that heel. Heel is the last thing you feel the power of going through. Good. How many was that? Four? Five? I might be off one. You might have just gotten away with one. Good. And six. Well, you guys are really making these look easy. And seven. Good. And eight. And eight. And eight. Last two. Last one. Good. Shake it out. I should have told you to get some water. You might want to do that. Get a little get a little drink of your water. All right. Okay. So what we're gonna do now, we're gonna do something different. Okay. Let's just, this is what you're gonna do. So watch me first. You're gonna come up onto your toes and you're gonna slide your back down an imaginary wall. So I'm gonna see how my back's straight. Okay, my head's cut off. My back is straight. So, so I'm on my toes. My back is on an imaginary wall. My belly's pulled in. I'm balancing. I want you to go up a little bit, come down a little bit. Up a little bit, come down a little bit. No, I'm on my toes, though. Get on your toes. Are you up on your toes, Anton? I can't tell. Maybe hanging on to something might work. So you used to go up a little bit, go down a little bit. You should feel it in your quads. Go up and down. See how I'm hardly moving? I'm only going about this much, two inches. Keep going. You're going a little far, Anton. Look at Coach Chris. I'm barely, I'm like pretending my back's against a wall. I'm on my toes. Keep going. Get up on those toes, Josh. Five more. Five, four, three, two, one, and hold. Come down and hold. Get up, get your heels up. Heels up. Hold them up. Try to balance. Find a focal point. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, that's it, Lily, five, four, three, two, one, shake it out. Did you feel it here? Did you feel it in your quads? Yes? Okay, then you're doing it right. We're gonna do that one again. Okay. Shake your legs out. All right. So again, my feet are only this far apart. Okay, and I come, I bend my knee, I, I come up onto my toes, sorry, I come up onto my toes, and I pretend my back's going down an imaginary wall and my heels are up. That's the start position, pull your belly button in. Go up a little bit, go down a little bit. Go up a little bit, go down a little bit. Keep going. Keep those heels up. It's hard to, be, it's not easy to balance, so it helps to find something to look at. Keep lifting your heels, keep pulling your core, and this is a lot of core strength to stay balanced. 15 seconds, and then we hold. Just a little bit, go up. You're sliding your back up and down, imaginary wall. Your toe, your heels stay lifted. If you're not dropping your heels, three, two, one, Come down and hold. Come to a low position. 
Belly's in. Five, four, three, two, one. Shake it out. All right, that is a lot of energy in my thighs. Okay, let's work some of that out. So let's do a couple of the calf raises. So calf raises is kind of what we were just doing, but we're gonna do them moving. So I want you to start with your hands on your hips, have your toes pointing forward, okay? So you come up on your toes and come all the way down. Go up and down, that's two. Up, hold, and down. Feel your calves um, activate, four, down, five, down, six, down, seven, down, eight, down, nine, down, last one, 10, down. Now, take your toes turned out like this. Same drill, so your toes are turned out. And again, you're gonna go now up, hold, and down. Up and down. So pause at the top. Three, four, five, six, seven, good job. Eight, nine, ten, and shake your legs out. We got one more. Okay, hey, turn your toes in. Ready, and go up and down. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and hold on 10. Hold up, hold. Try to balance, keep pushing up through your toes, and relax, shake your legs out. All right, the last thing we have is we're gonna do our lunge, we're gonna do our squats, but we're gonna do our squats to the side. We're gonna go one side together, and then the other side, okay? And we're gonna hold, on each one, but you're stepping, but you're doing a whole, not a lunge though, players watch. Watch Coach Chris, watch me first, watch. I'm stepping, I'm doing a regular squat, and then I come up, and I come together. Down, well you can you can come up and come together, but make sure it's not, it's not the lunge, it's different, okay? So get ready, step this way, and step, and down. In your squat, hold, get, your, get into your squat, show me you got a good squat, Push on this leg and come back up again. And go this side. Hold. And come up. And switch. Hold. Good squat. Good. Push those hips back. Come up. And the other one. Hold. Come up. Good job. And step. Push those hips back. Nice. Together. Out. Together, this is, I think, I don't know, I think this might be five. We'll say it is five. Five to the other side. Five, good job. Six. Six, we're gonna hold the last two on each side, so you're gonna get ready for that. Seven, good. Seven. Eight. Eight, nine, nine, get ready to hold the 10th one on this side and hold, hold. 20 seconds, stay. Ten seconds, stay there, Josh, you can do it. Five seconds, then we stand up, then we go right into the next one. And up, the blood go in, get ready, and down again for 20. Hold. 
You're almost done, players. You got it. 10 seconds. And up, shake it out. All right, guess what? Now we stretch, okay? So go ahead and grab hold of something or go ahead and grab onto your foot. Do your, do your quad stretch, pulling that bent knee behind your standing leg. You can hang on to each other. That might work, actually, if you want to hang on to each other. That's it. All right, other side. Shift your weight. Find something to look at. And remember, you always got the old nose trick. If you have nothing to look, if you have nothing to hang on to. Okay. Let's bring that knee up to the front. Pull your belly button in, pull your shoulders down, find that focal point, find something to look at at eye level or below that's not moving. Keep pulling that knee in, whoa. And switch. Okay, bring that down. Let's go ahead and clasp your hands. Push your palms down, lift up. Bring your feet out to the side and lean one way, feel that big stretch. And come up, go the other way. And come up. And now I know you do this one with Coach Krista, but you come down in a circle. Go around, and now go the other way. All right. I think that's it, kiddos.